port city of Valencia has over 300 sunny days a year. And its average temperature of 19 degrees Celsius makes Spain's third biggest city an ideal travel destination all year round. My name is Raquel Martinez. Uh, I think Valencia is really great because of the weather and also because of the people, because we are really nice and friendly people. I think uh, you should visit the City of Arts and Science, uh, which was designed by Calatrava. The City of Arts and Sciences was designed by Valencian architect Santiago Calatrava in the 1990s. Its futuristic buildings form Valencia's leisure and cultural center. Biking in the in the in the city now is very easy because everything is being adapted to to the bikes. So it's it's turning to a green city, which is something something good. Uh, Jardín Turia, which was the river before, and uh, after the flood in the 50s, they had to change the direction and they converted into a the longest uh, park in Europe, and it's really green and. Very nice to, to go to walk, also with a bike. El Jardín de Turia is over nine kilometers long and considered Valencia's green lung. The park is the perfect spot to stop and take a breather in the middle of the city. visit Valencia, the most important uh, to visit is Central Market. The Central Market is historic uh, market in Valencia. It's a centenary market. In the Central Market, uh, you can see all the products and the quality of the products is the best. Designed in Valencian Art Nouveau, the covered market was built in the early 20th century. It's one of the biggest markets for fresh products in Europe and spans 8,000 square meters. Its decorations are inspired by products sold here. Bueno, yo soy canónigo de la catedral y mi nombre es Miguel Bou. Lo mejor para ver de Valencia es la catedral, el Miguelete. Si podéis subir arriba, desde arriba hay muy buena vista. The bell tower of Valencia Cathedral was built in Gothic style and is 63 meters in total. The terrace is at 51 meters, with a breathtaking view of the sea and the city of arts and sciences. Me llamo Josep Gomar, soy historiador, eh, trabajo aquí desde hace cuatro años. La torre tiene 207 escalones, es como subir 15 o 16 pisos. Y bueno, hay que estar un poco en forma, pero tampoco es para tanto. Cualquier día que vayas a la montaña haces un poco más que eso. Así que... My name is Borja Bevis. I'm living here in Valencia. I'm from Valencia and I work as an agricultural engineer. It's very common here that uh, we eat paella like once a week or every two weeks. And for us, one of the best places to eat paella in Valencia is uh, Barc de Maet. Valencia is the paella capital. Rural communities invented the rice dish here between the 15th and 16th century. The original paella valenciana was made with rabbit meat and chicken. The version with seafood didn't come about until much later. My name is Nestor Bacaro. I'm a manager of uh, Bar Cremaet. And well, uh, we're talking here about paella. Paella is part of the culture of Valencia. If you could go around Spain and eat many good things, but if you want to eat rice and good paella, you need to come to Valencia. Valencia offers nice weather, friendly people, numerous attractions, and great food. What more could you ask for?